गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज योर जी के क्लास नाउ वी विल लर्न द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक और द नेक्स्ट चैप्टर दैट इज डिफेंस मैकेनिज्म ऑफ एनिमल्स दिस इज पेज नंबर एट नाउ डिफेंस मैकेनिज्म ऑफ एनिमल्स मीन्स हाउ डू एनिमल्स प्रोटेक्ट डेम सेल्स फ्रॉम द एनिमीज और अदर एनिमल्स the first we can see in the picture is horned lizard horned lizard also known as horned toads live in desert or semi desert areas when they feel they are in danger they inhale air and expand their bodies to look big and strong this is a horned lizard when it sees other animals or its enemies what does it do it inhale lot of air inside and expand its body to look big and strong so the other animal will think that the horned lizard is very big and they cannot fight with it now second is hairy frogs this is the picture of a hairy frog hairy frogs have hair like structures on their sides which help them get more oxygen when these frogs feel they are under attack they break the bones of their own toe pads to allow cat like claws to come out and scare away the attackers what does it do when it sees other enemy it break the bones of their own toe okay to allow cat like claws claws you know you have studied in evs also the birds have claws the cats have claws it is called in hindi panja to come out and scare away the attackers the attackers get afraid of these claws of the hairy frogs so they don't come closer to this frog next is opossums these are of the size of cats when they feel they are in real danger they pretend to be dead and produce a smell like that of a dead body this makes their attackers lose interest and go away what does what does this opossum do it pretends himself that he is dead and produce a smell which is not good which which is very bad smell a smell of a dead body so the attacker don't come closer as the attacker or the enemy think that this animal is dead so they leave leave this and go away from opossums next is electric eel electric eel are long south american fish which can generate strong electric shocks to kill their prey and scare away their attackers they can produce a 300 to 650 volt charge a charge powerful enough to stun humans also now what is a electric eel it is a type of a fish found in south american waters this fish produces a current which is 300 to 650 volt charge which is very powerful current with this current the humans can also be stunned the humans can also get a shock if they touch this eel fish now the any attacker in the water who comes closer to this fish will get a electric shock and run away now the next is rattlesnake rattlesnakes are also called big are are so called because of the rattle like structure they have on the tips of their tails the buzzing sound of this rattle works as a warning device when in danger the snakes use the 
vibrating rattle to warn their enemies to stay away. Now rattle means a sound of rattling type of sound. It produces a sound from its tail. There is a structure made at the end of the tail which produces this sound, the buzzing sound. When the sound is produced, the enemies don't come closer to this snake. So this snake protects itself from this rattling sound. The next is newts. Newts of type of amphibian are known to protect themselves by secreting poison from their skin. This is a newt. The Spanish ribbed newt, a special species of newt, also protects itself by using its sharp ribs as a weapon. How does this newt protect itself? It, it secretes, it produces the poison from the skin. So any other animal or enemy come closer to this newt will touch the skin and will get affected or will be killed by that poison so they don't come closer to this newt so this is defense mechanism of animals the first one was horned lizard second hairy frogs horned lizard it swells up or inhales air to expand the body these frogs produces claws like cats so they can fight with their enemies this opossum makes itself dead so the attackers or the enemies think the opossum is dead and they ignore him and move away the eel fish produces electric shocks to protect itself rattlesnake produces sound a buzzing sound to protect itself the newts produces poison from their skin to protect itself so these are the animals this is their defense mechanism now we come to quick quiz what is the only animal to grow antlers that are branched and shed every year that is deer second question which sea animal comes to land to lay eggs that is turtle you have seen turtle or you have not seen you can see it in the videos other on youtube videos that how turtles come on land the third question is which animal is endangered because of its ivory tusks that is elephant endangered means those animals which are very less means they are very less in number on earth because the humans are killing those animals so this elephant is very endangered animal why they are killing why they why the humans are killing the, these anim, uh, elephants because of their ivory tusk these and elephants have ivory tusk means those long teeth of the elephants are made of ivory and those teeth are used to make other ornaments or things that is why humans kill these elephants which question number four which is the world's largest animal that is blue whale question five which bird found in antarctica can swim but not fly that is penguin i have already told you in the evs class penguins are very heavy weighted birds 
दे के नॉट फ्लाई दो दे हैव फैदर्स बट दे के नॉट फ्लाई सिक्स क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स विच लॉन्ग हेयर्ड ऑक्स लाइक एनिमल फाउंड इन दी माउंटेन्स ऑफ टिबेट इज अ सोर्स ऑफ मिल्क एंड क्लॉथिंग दैट इज याक याक इज एन एनिमल ऑक्स लाइक एनिमल फाउंड इन दी माउंटेन्स ऑफ टिबेट इज अ सोर्स ऑफ मिल्क एंड क्लॉथिंग द याक गिवस मिल्क एज वेल एज वुल दिस वुल इज कम्स फ्रॉम देयर स्किन द ह्यूमन्स कट दोज वुल फ्रॉम द स्किन एंड मेक clothes out of those wolves now this ends up this second chapter please fill this exercise please fill this exercise in your books okay thank you children we will do next chapter in the next class and this is your homework to fill the exercise thank you